incoming message. Incoming message. Hi, and welcome back to Stewie Plays Elite Dangerous, and this is our path to a fleet carrier. I've been mining lots and lots and lots, as this appears to be the quickest and easiest way to get to the five billion total that we need just to buy the ship. That's not outfitting it. That's not taking other ships into into account. That's just so we can purchase a carrier. Obviously, I will go over that five billion, but that is my target. Hopefully, I'll get there before the uh, the launch of the the update. But so far, I've been doing this in my little mining ship. Oop, wrong button. which is just an ASP Explorer. I've got a few too many lasers on here. I just use the two large beams, to be honest, but uh, yeah, I have it that way anyway. Quick little scroll through the optional internals. Obviously cargo racks, fuel scoop, limpet controllers. 3A, two of those. A refinery, six bins, very handy for storing six full amounts uh, per bin when you're on your way back then to get a quick six million extra and a detailed surface scanner turns out you do need this equipped every time otherwise you lose the hotspot location so that was a lesson learned on my part now despite it having no shields I was a little worried for pirates but there's an easy way to avoid those uh, simply you hover you hover about uh, wait for everything to spawn in, and then basically, as soon as they've scanned you, they lose interest. You make a beeline well out of the way, and then just mine uh, well out of their range. Um, I believe eventually they, they leave the area and just um, uh, they ju just jump out, basically. Now, what I'm thinking is, um, I'm getting close to my first billion. Hopefully this run now will take me into my first uh, billion, which will be 20% of the way towards a fleet carrier. So I'm going to set off and I'll then jump back into a little bit of uh, mining, how I set up, and then we'll be taking it from there. And here we are at the best mining spot that I know of. Boran and this planet is Boran A2. The rings that you want here uh, basically is the low temperature diamonds. There's three of them overlapping. Okay, resource extraction site, ignore that. What we want is over here. So if you can just about see, there's one, there's two, there's three. So what I want to try and do is I'll target this one here and I'll aim up to get an overlap of all three. Roughly, yeah, let's go for let's get the writing out of the way. Let's go for roughly here. Now, you don't want to approach too fast otherwise you will damage your hull so the closer we get the more I'm gonna slow down manually and then we're just gonna drop in and we'll go through the process of how I avoid the pirates so we get close now Slow the speed a bit more. And again. Whoosh. And we've, 
taking no damage to our hull. So I'm going to fly towards the belt now. I've got the hotspot uh, located on my uh, targeted and I'm going to use that as a point of reference so that I'm always going to be flying towards it. It's so far away that I'm not going to reach it by the time I've filled up um, on low temperature diamonds. So hopefully now if we just hover about here, ah, this is either going to be a miner or a pirate. And he's probably going to be a miner if he's in that ship. Our second contact is going to be a pirate. Or not. Where are these multiples coming in now? Now this is a pirate. Oh my god, every time I say pirate, it's something else. Ugh. What's this one? Nope, just security services. We need a pirate to come along. Okay. If this is going to be the only ships there are. Lock back on our temperature hotspot, um, low temperature diamond hotspot, and we'll make our way across here. distance away from everyone now, so we're outside the spawning area of ships. So it's going to be a fair bit of boosting. Now I was contemplating upgrading to Python, thinking like, oh yeah, I could double my carrying capacity. But, yeah, I can afford it. Yes, I'll be running with shields. The only thing that's put me off that, apart from, obviously I want to save money. Flight assist on. I'd be basically jumping more. I don't want to run around engineering. I've made almost a billion. At the end of this run, hopefully I have made a billion. Just out of this ship. So, it's jump range is what 20 20 light years fully laden um you can virtually half that for the uh for the python unless i go out of my way stop what i'm doing and then start mining uh start um unlocking the the engineers which i don't want to do at this stage i just purely want to grind out the credits so I think we have gone far enough now. So we're going to change to this now and we're going to start targeting different, uh, different asteroids. So, sorry if I'm a bit slow about this now. I'm trying to concentrate on what I'm doing, talk and not crash. <laughs> Programming limpet drone. Cargo scoop deployed. So we target this now. Prospector limpet engaged. Low temperature diamonds, 13%. Yeah, that's a bit low for what Asteroid I like. Asteroid scan complete. Programming 
Gonna fire off another one. Seventeen, that's doable. Ideally, I'm hoping for Asteroid twenty to thirty percent. And in a triple hotspot, you can afford to be picky. There's there's no two ways about it. Just fly about. You can fly in a straight line and just fire on one, move straight over, fire to another one, and you will find them high. To be honest, so. But for the purpose of just getting some footage. Programming limpid drone. And this is all I've been doing. You don't need shields, don't need to worry about pirates. Easy peasy. Okay, there's our first low temperature diamond. And it's coming in in good chunks. So, I'll crack on with this. And then I'll meet you back in the space station in a moment. So, we've made it back safe. Now to check out and see what the prices are like. With a bit of luck they haven't dropped too much. Oh, good. They've held. Incoming message. And there we are. We have our first 1 billion. 20% of the way towards our total goal. And, as an added bonus, We've now just made elite rank, purely by mining. Here's all the promotions. And this is the latest one we've just got. Congratulations, Commander, in recognition. <laughs> elite. So. Wonder how long it'll take us to get uh, triple elite. So I am well pleased with that. Like I said, I th did think about going the way of uh, buying um, a python, uh, simply so that I could run with shields and have more cargo space. But this ship is doing fantastic. Considering it's such an early on ship, um, it's it's been a pure workhorse for uh, for mining, and you know what I mean. And what's this? Eight eight mining runs. Um, one billion. I can't really fault it. In fact, I probably will keep uh, going with this ship until I hit the five billion. Um, I can't really see a reason to change it, to be quite honest. So, if you've liked what you've seen, and any of it has been helpful or mildly amusing or entertaining, um, even if you dislike it, uh, give us a thumbs up, give us a thumbs down, let me know how I can improve things, and I will see you all in the next episode.